so you've got a lot of recognition from big wave surfing and then the sponsors and Mercedes. What's your, how do you give back to the community and the environment? What's the best way for you to kind of give back from what you've, what you've gained? Well, in Portugal with Nazare, it's just been amazing. Just everybody is just so happy what has transpired there. We got there and there was literally not one person at the lighthouse the whole winter. The next winter, a few more people show up, and now you can't drive your car down there. There's thousands of people oh. there on the big days. So for Portugal, we really brought a lot to Nazare in the wintertime when there's nothing going on. In the summer, it's crowded, but the winter is nothing. But there we do a beach cleanup with Surfrider, which is annual, and um, Surfrider Portugal. And it's a great way to just show the children what happens when you throw something on the ground three miles away, a mile away, three miles away, five miles away, it ends up in a storm drain, comes out on in the water and it ends up on the beach. And we pick up all these things on the beach and they're just like, they can't believe that something that there's no way it should be on the beach and, and it's on the beach. So we educate them and you activate one kid at a time and, mm -hmm. and, uh, then there's uh, surfers healing for taking autistic children surfing. We go all over the East Coast and a little bit on the West Coast. This year we didn't have time with the baby and all, but um, it's really amazing to provide a service for these families. These these you know, once your child is diagnosed with autism, a lot of your hopes and dreams just out the door mm -hmm. and. They never really dream of their child ever surfing. And so we have a day for the families to bring their children and we take them surfing and the parents are on the beach and they're crying. We're coming and we're crying. Everybody's crying. It's, it's tears of joy and tears of sadness. And, and it really just recharges my battery. I, mean, I feel selfish because it makes me feel so good and just sharing our passion, what we love with somebody who would never imagine surfing. And that's another way I give back. And, you know, there's um, so many different things you can do, but I just love doing surf for ceiling. I love bringing awareness to the beaches and we're working with Surf Rider. Wow. Yeah, actually here at this school, we're, we're looking to activate a, a junior club, a Surf Rider junior club for this school. And that's one of the goals of this. 